Ladies and gentlemen, this is Wayne Dre from Scroop. We're doing it live, and this is episode, well, this is the next episode, in our XCOM Let's Play, or XCOM Enemy Within Let's Play. That's a new area over there. I've never seen that area before. Hmm. wonder if that has to do something. No, uh, maybe. No, it doesn't say. Huh. Weird. But, okay. Sorry, I had to look at some. So, last time we did a bunch of stuff. Um, we had our first UFO attack. We had, we went over kind of situation room. We did Grey Market. Sold off the parts that we had. And, what else did we do? We actually didn't do much last episode. We just did a couple of the first missions. And, still don't have enough engineers to build the app facility. Okay. But we haven't launched any satellites yet, so not really an issue. So, we're going to scan for activity and head into our next... Ooh! Abduction site. Commander, we picked up multiple requests for assistance. Abductions in progress are marked on the... So... <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. With this one, I think we're going to go... Australia, Egypt, or Russia. Now, I usually go engineers, because we do need engineers. Um... I think I might want scientists. Scientists help with research. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with scientists. No, let's go engineers. Cause scientists come up a little bit better with um Okay, so we've got a lot of people injured. <laughs> let's check our Real quick, let's check our barracks and see who's actually hurt. Everybody is wounded. Wow, okay. This is going to be a fun mission. Um, <laughs> so many recruits. We're going to have to play this one real safe. And hopefully, nothing goes horribly, terribly, horribly, horribly wrong. <coughs> Sorry about that. Touching down. Australia, it is. Australia has sent a number of requests for assistance, so that's our next drop site. So we have to get the meld containers and kill all the hostiles. Okay, that was kind of cool. This is central. You are free to engage all hostile contacts in the AO. Don't take Let's see if chances. we can find our meld canisters. Just so we can kind of plan which way we are going. Okay, I can't see anything yet. So, we come this way. I do want to get inside that building. So, what we are going to do is get right up here. So you can see kind of inside. Nothing inside. So it's going to be in the back. Oh. No, it's up on the roof. It's on the bloody roof. Okay, so we've got to get one of our guys up there. So I'm gonna put her here, and I'm gonna put him defending here. So now, chances are, the other one is gonna be somewhere over here. Okay, let's go with Zizhenko. Oh, never put her in Overwatch. Because we only have four turns, so we have to run and get it quickly. Now I'm going to get Makuba up here and in position. And then I'm going to move to him. Get him up there. 
Now she hasn't seen anything. Is there absolutely no cover up there? Oh, no. Um, I'm gonna get him some defense. And these guys are gonna go... Defensive here. There we go. Got some enemies. But our two guys up top will have the upper hand because they're up higher. Hmm. That's not a lot of cover. I don't want to put these guys in as much cover as possible because there's a lot of glass around. So they can see pretty much straight through this place. Okay. So something just went on. Somebody's getting shot at. Ah, and she took a lot of hit. So, let's get... Can we collect this thing? See, this game is glitchy. There we go. So there's enemies over here. We've heard that now. And chances are the other melt container is going to be up on this roof. I can't see it. Though. Ooh. There it is. I see it. So we want to bring our guys this way. Definitely want to get these guys into a bit more cover. So actually, I want to throw her, get him. No, I'm gonna get her out of there. I want to get her. Can we get her up here? No, apparently she cannot climb. Zinchenko. Put you in as much cover as possible. Let's do this. Now the chances are, if they try to run up here, my guys will shoot them. So we're kind of safe for right now. Okay, so somebody's getting mine melded. Oh, that's not good. Oh, maybe it is. Yes, one guy is down. Although, she is still not in a good position. Moving. Okay, we need to get her over here to see above the edge. Okay, so there's the other meld container. Nope, I want you to... Overwatch. Now somebody melded, so if he can see him, ooh, we are set for that shot. Oh, only two damage. That hurts. Now we are in a good position because we actually have the high ground. Hmm, didn't take too much damage. Not too bad. Now. Okay, so she's... Can she run up here? Get up top. Okay, so there's where the other guy went. There we go. Okay, so now we switch our view. Now 
Now there's our guy. There's the little bastard. Let's run and gun it. Put her right here. And a crit. So, now we can get him down to some cover. Watch. But I want to secure that meld first. So I'm going to run up to it. Via, grab it. Grab it. And then here. Assad. I want you down on the ground. Will do. Covering all angles. On the move. No. See her? I want you here. And cover. So I've got her out of the way because she's pretty injured. So Okay, so it looks like they she uh that alien ran that way. On the move. See if we can get a shot on or sight on. So let's get these guys better firing positions. Let's get him back behind some solid cover. So we know the aliens are back where we started, so they're probably watching us. Oh no! I think I heard something. They're right there. Oh, that's not good. Holy shit. Um, I think this might be the last alien. We use running gun. Oh yeah. Moving out. Hello, and flanking, so guess what? You're dead. Nailed him. Mission accomplished. Done. Wow, that was actually a little bit, not as smooth as I would have liked it, but pretty smooth nonetheless. We got all the things, we killed all the aliens, and we didn't lose a single crew member. That's the way I like it. Plus we got all the meld. And we've got another support and another assault. How many supports do I have? And they're both injured, so I have... Uh, ah. We now have the workshop. We have four engineers now. And we've increased we panic across Europe commander. and Africa. So, now we can go into here and launch our satellite. Now, I like to wait to launch the satellite to see what areas need the... Um... Mm. Need the uh, panic reduction that giving a satellite gives. Now, I could go with Egypt, get 110 per month, and an engineer per month. Or, I can go Russia and get two scientists per month and 140 per month. I'm kind of leaning towards 140 per month and two scientists because more scientists equal faster research. So, we will go with Europe. Launch the satellite. Now, what we need to do with that is go into our hangar, view the ship lists, and Raven 1 is repairing, and so we need to send two interceptors to Europe. Now, you notice that they're worth, they're, they only cost 
20 or 40 a month or 40 dollars for the two so they're 20 each and that's one of the bonuses that you get from having North America as your whoop, um, starting base so as you see Russia was at three now it's at two because of the lowered um, because of the fact that there's going to be a satellite there uh, one of the good things about the game that you can help with that um, let's see how our research our research is almost done so we'll have ah okay so Raven 1 just got repaired which is great um, now if I revest available for manufacture so I want to pick up three of those um, I want to go xenobiology. Technology has a number of potential applications. I'm sure the science Actually, team is eager to begin. Experimental we'll warfare. As as yeah, I definitely want to go with some of these lower end ones. So yeah, I definitely want to do xenobiology because that gets us a bunch of engineers different arrived this morning, Commander. We're okay, so we got nine engineers. I'm gonna manufacture three of these for right now because we only have three people. Um, I also want to. Build a satellite. Commander, our current satellite uplink facilities are at full capacity. Because these take a while, so I like to have one, at least one of them on standby. So we've got a nice chunk of stuff here to do or to wait for. Uh, barracks. We've suffered a number of casualties and haven't found suitable replacements yet. We need to start hiring additional soldiers through the barracks. Yeah, we got really screwed up the last couple of missions. Um. But we are going to get our sniper and our heavy back, um, and depending on how the next couple of days goes. So now we've got our um, heavy and our sniper back, so we've got a decent team ready. Interceptors are ready over Europe, and our excavation is complete as well. So I want to check where that was. Okay, so now we can be build. A thermo generator, if we had enough money. Hmm. What we can do is we actually don't have enough money for anything right now. Huh. Well, that sucks. But we have a couple of things coming in that we can do to get money. So, like this council report, that gives us a lot of money. Ooh. So, all of our high-end guys just came back in action. I think we only have one more left, and that's Ryan. He was just really screwed up, so. But, yeah, we've got our, we've got, yeah, sorry. We can now see kind of how many of each class we have. We have three assaults, which is pretty good. Uh, a heavy, a sniper, and two supports. Now, I would like to get another sniper, but we will see what we can do with that. Um, but, let's keep going. Ah, some Commander, more abductions. We're tracking several reported abductions via the Hologlobe. I've got the coordinates locked in. Now, we have a support that can go to Sergeant Class. I don't really like the supports. If it was anything other than support... Ooh. Whoops. Any abductions. Okay. Sorry, I hit the spacebar by accident. So, um... With this one, I actually want to get... Hmm. Actually... Who's panicking? Mm, not many. Um. Actually, grabbing the support would actually help a lot. So we're gonna go to Argentina. Yep, we're gonna go to Argentina. So you've got uh, assault support. Make items available. Accept. Loadout. There. We also didn't do our customization, which I will do real quick right now. Joan Wagner. Is all set. William Robinson. Robin Williams. So she's a heavy assault. Back loadout. Is she on a mission? No, she's just active. Okay, so let's go back to our group. And let's edit this unit. Load out. Give him that. Back. Back. Customize. I have to give him 
Sorry, I'm doing this really quick on the fly. You can kind of see how I customize my units. Load out. Whoop. Nope. And a fiber vest. And rookie Zinchenko. Let out. Let's give him that. Now, I don't know why my sniper ain't in this crew. Let's actually edit her, take back the vest, and let's put our sniper in here. I don't know why our sniper hasn't gone in there. There we go. Edit unit, and for right now, until we get the... Uh, we can actually make a scope for the snipers so they are a little more accurate, but... I want to wait till we get one more person into the squad. Well, we actually have to research it first, so... Acapulco, Mexico. Prepare for deployment, strike one. Begin the assault. We're moving into Argentina next. The threat there seems to be the most pressing. Okay. Alien activity continues to surge within several major cities. Our response is crucial to minimizing the spread of panic. Yes, yes, yes. We're always trying to save panic. Okay. Sorry about that. And quick thing. Look around, see if we can see any of the meld containers right off the bat. So you can rush and get those. I don't see one. But let's move our guys forward and see what we can see. So she's our sniper, so we want to move her doubly. I want to move her here. I like the supports, they can run a little further. Um, let's move him up to that stone. And let's move you let's up here. Alien object in sight. Aha! So where is our meld container? I didn't see where it was. Okay, so it's back that way. Hmm. 55 and 55. Let's... Eh, no, let's take a shot. 55% chance to hit. Low cover and she's only got 75. Eh, let's go. Yes! One alien down. Okay, so let's move... Actually, she can't see shit, so let's move her... Here. And the alien will be able to be a shot. Let's take the shot, see what we can get. Yes! We got our kill. Okay, so our meld container is over here. So we're going to have him sprint over and... I want to put a wall between me and anything else. Ooh, there's some more guys. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to get him here and put him on Overwatch. So just in case they move. So this is actually the second meld container. The first one is in a weird position currently. Okay, so that one's getting melded by the guy in the corner. Hmm. I don't want to get that getting shot, so I'm going to move into a position here. Let's move her. Ooh. Um, do we know where the second container is? I kind of want to move this in a way. Let's just kind of quickly get us to the second container. Or first, well, first container, actually. Um, let's give him some support. At least move him out of the way. Hmm. Okay. Low cover. Can't see shit, so we're gonna put her on Overwatch. We're gonna run her up here. Where's our rookie? Ooh! There's our Overwatch. Yeah. 
Oh, hit the, wow. That did a lot of damage. Okay, so the other one is this way. Oh boy. Okay, let's run up here, grab that. And it's not working. There we go. Oh my god. Such a pain to do this. Heading there now. Ooh. That was a good lineup. Hmm. Let's go three. Move you there. Let's do a six. Let's get you. Ooh! Well, that kind of fucked up. Okay, so he went Overwatch. He's gonna try and move out. He's probably gonna shoot at something. Oh no, he went Overwatch. Okay. Ooh, 63, 60. Let's take this guy. He's just standing there like a fucking retard. Yes! Okay, so we've cleared our... We've cleared this guy to get into position on this door. Cover. Let's take that shot. Damn. Should have moved her closer. But she's probably going to get shot at, but... No! Wow. Okay. Hmm. He's going to shoot him. Which missed. Actually, this is when we use. Okay, that sounded fun. Okay, so there's our other milk container. But how this works is if we can actually get these guys defeated. Going in for the kill. Um, this doesn't work. We're still going to be in cover. So, hello. Goodbye. Oh! But it didn't do enough damage. That's the issue. Um, can we get our other guy up there to take a shot? Oh, yes, we can. He's actually going to be in a decent position to shoot. Hmm, let's see if he can take the kill. Damn it! Uh, let's go there. And support all your ass. I was gonna say he's gonna try and move and flank, but even he I was gonna say even if he crits, he's not gonna get much damage on me. Um uh, I need to get to that meld container. 75% chance to hit. Let's move you right there. Visual on the goods. You have a 100% chance to kill him. If you... There we go. So that was the last one. Now, that's weird that our aliens are only doing... There's only like four aliens per map. We actually haven't hit any of the... The big aliens yet. We haven't seen any Thin Men or... Any of the other ones. It's weird. Hmm. And we have another Heavy. Yay, Zinchenko just got upgraded to a heavy. Now our assault got wounded, but the good thing about having three assaults is, well, you have three assaults. 
Oh. Urban Combat Badge is now unlocked. Visit the barracks to designate a special capability for this medal. Rename it and award it to a soldier. Huh. International Service is now unlocked. Visit the barracks to designate... Ooh. Those are new. I'm not entirely sure what those do. Adriana Moreno. Remember, support class. We will be watching. So if we go to view our soldiers. Commanders, she you can wants now honor upgrade. our soldiers by awarding them medals for accomplishments you deem appropriate. You can view and award medals in the barracks. Okay. So, she's our support. She's our highest ranking support right now. Um, I can do covering fire for this. And smoking mirrors. Okay. And now we customize her to our colors. There we go. Oh, and she, once you reach, I think it's squad, or sergeant, you get a nickname. So she's got our first nickname. Um, what I want to have is another med pack. Do I have enough money to... Nineteen dollars. Okay, that's not too bad. Okay, so now we've got that extra barracks. Okay. Actually, I want to take a look at how bad this got. Okay, so you uh, so North America is kind of panicking, but we've got we should be able to do enough missions that keeps that down. Um, there's a lot of stuff that we should be able to do that will lower the panic and that kind of stuff, especially council missions. Council missions reduce panic a lot. Um, in certain areas, obviously, but it's always good to do those. Um, this is the gray market. Yeah, we have only set, we've only faced sectoids so far, which is kind of weird. But we've got plenty of meld. We've got plenty of monthly income at the end of the month, which should be coming up in about 16 days. But Xenobiology will be done, so we'll be able to actually continue the storyline. And, but, this is where we're going to call it a wrap for this episode. So this has been Wayne Dre from Screw It, We're Doing It Live. Hope you guys are enjoying so far. Um, between this episode and next episode, I'm going to kind of look up with the badges, uh, see what, what they do and what they're used for, and if they do anything special, and then we'll we can see if we can award some medals to some of our guys. Um, but until then, again, I, this is Wayne Dre, and I hope to see you guys next time. Bye-bye.